Hey everybody, No Guts, No Glory. Welcome back to my channel. All right, we're gonna round this up with the last LTD haul out of the three that I said, because it surely ain't gonna be my last LTD haul. Mm-mm, uh-uh. <laughs> I will always continue to buy from them. I love that store. And, the, and they make such nice stuff. It's quality stuff. The prices aren't bad. And I like to do some of my Christmas shopping off of there for my family and friends. So, yeah. I'm one of those who already has Christmas stuff put aside already uh, for this year for Christmas. So that's just me. All right, this is a very small haul. And for this one, I only paid $3 for the shipping and handling. I thought I paid 5 for all three on each one of them, but this one was 3 Okay, so let's start with, let's see, what should I start with? I'll start with the piece de la resistance which is my little gnome guy you would have seen in part the first one before this the little girl that i had gotten and i probably didn't even tell you the price on that one on that video but they are 9.99 so they're ten dollars and i got the little boy to go with the little girl so here he is here holding his little egg and again, I told you they're weighted on the bottom to stand up, but here he is with his little blue hat. <laughs> so see, I got the, I got the girl and the boy. <laughs> I thought they were adorable. Gonna put them out. Yep, Easter, spring. So I got him. And then many of you remember that I, from in the other previous, haul that I had gotten the little rabbit wreath well they had other pieces that go to that collection so I got the tree there's the little tree isn't it pretty and there it is there that's what the bottom looks like very pretty good size so I'm going to put that out for decor. The little tree was, they call it wood curl tree. It was $12.99. Then I got the little candle holder. Now I'm, I'm hoping I can find, I thought of removing the little dish in it anyway. I got to work with it because I thought it was going to be bigger where I could put like a a Bath and Body Works candle in it, but obviously it's not that big for that to hold that. But I'll figure out something. Here is the candle holder, the ring. That's what the bottom looks like. There it is there. See how it comes with a votive, glass votive inside for you to put a votive, but I didn't want to put a votive. So I don't know what I'll do. If I'll leave that like that and just use it and put, I don't know, little stuff whatever in there I don't know we'll figure it out or if I want to remove it and try to just put a pillar type candle sitting in there I don't know you guys got any other suggestions you can leave them down below in the comment section but I thought it was very pretty I'm going to put that out as well for all of my spring Easter decor stuff and the little candle holder was or is, let's see, $9.99. All right, and then the last thing that I picked up was, all right, I'm trying to find my phone. I'm gonna see if I could <coughs> pull it up for you here so that I can read you the description of it or let's see, or show you a picture of it all lit up. It is solar, so that's why in it's probably not going to light up for you now, but let me see if I can find my orders here, which I probably can't. We're going to, anyway, I can't find it for you, and I hate making you guys wait, but let's see. Solar, maybe I can look it up that way. Solar plant. All right, we're going to look up solar plants. There they are. Yay. All right. It comes in green and it 
also comes in purple. I wanted the purple because I thought the purple would just stand out nice and vibrant outside. But here, it comes in this box here. All right. And I, like I said, I got the purple. What these are, uh, let's see. It is... Here is the solar part that it comes with a stake. So you would attach the stake to it. Let's see here. Here's the stake. You attach the stake to this so that this will go in the ground. And then you just point this up to the sky so that you can get the sun on it. And it's solar. So it will light up all of the lights. There are a bunch, a bunch of fairy lights that are all in this. You probably can't see them, but there are a ton of little fairy lights. So I thought I would put this outside. I'm going to get a little planter, just like the picture shows, put it in it. They look like this. That's the green set right there. Now I'm going to show you the purple set that I had got. Here's the purple set if you want to just put them in the ground and no flower pot whatsoever. That's what they would look like when they get the light, the solar light, and they light up at night. But anyway, because they're solar powered. But that's what they look like when they light up. Isn't that pretty? And it was... Oh, it says solar half bulb ground plants in purple. It was $15. So, that's what I got. I think that'll look really pretty outside. And that's it. That's my small little haul. This one wasn't very large at all. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you'll check them out. You know, and if you want to subscribe to my Instagram and Facebook so you know when they're having a good sale. My links are down below in the description box. Send me a message with your request saying, Kathy, I know you from YouTube. Or, hey. <laughs> That'll also say, hey, she must know me from YouTube because she said, hey. And I'll add you. Otherwise, I won't because my, pro my pages are private. All right, guys. Remember to always let go like God. No guts, no glory. God bless us all. And we'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm. Bye, guys.